Hey guys, welcome back to another Unreal Engine 4 tutorial. In today's video I'm going to be merging two of my other videos. So I'm going to be merging together the AI chase with music that I've done and then also the AI patrolling. So what it's going to do is it's going to be patrolling and if it sees the player it's going to chase him and when it stops seeing the player and it stops chasing it will go back to patrolling. So let's get right into it. So what we're going to do first is we're going to want to open up our AI blueprint that we have. So I'm going to do that now. So I have this AI blueprint here. And this is our AI move to code that we have, or sorry, the AI patrolling code. And then up here is the AI chase code. So if you followed this patrolling, what you may have here is the event begin play node. I've already just deleted that as we're not going to be using that for this. So you can do that as well. So what we're going to do is actually just move this closer up here and we're going to come off of event tick. So as I told you, I said we're going to get a sequence as we're going to use this. So I'm going to come down here and I'm going to get a branch like so. And the false is going to come out and go into a do once node. That way that it will only do this once because it's coming off of event tick. And the completed is just going to go into our AI move to there. So like so, the do once will go straight into that AI move to branch is false. And the condition for our branch is going to be our is chasing boolean that we should already have like so. So event tick, if we're not chasing, go into the do once and then do this. And then a little tweak we're going to do on all of these is on fail, we're going to still then go into the AI move to there next to it and this is because it might not get there if it starts chasing the player so that way it knows it can then just go straight back onto the next one so it will carry on patrolling from where it left off so that's that part done and now what we're going to do at the very end of this code so of all of these ai move twos we're going to hold down s left click and get two sequences like so on success from this one it's going to go into the top sequence here and then zero will just go back into this reroute node up here to go into the first AI move to and then we'll do similar with the other sequence so the other sequence will come out of on fail so on fail we'll go into this sequence and then that will go into that reroute node as well to also go to the first AI move to and then both of these then ones are going to go in to the reset of our do once so you can drag those out and go into reset of do once like so on both of these sequences like that and this should now be it so you can put this in a function in a macro all of that to make it look a lot neater and better for you and we can also actually just plug in the on fail into that one sequence so we don't need two sequences there like that i tried it earlier but it didn't work but for some reason it does now so we will do that like so so on success and on fail go into this sequence then zero goes into our reroute node up here to go into the first ai move to and the then one goes into the reset of our do once so that we can then do this code again. So like I say, that should be done. So we compile, save, minimize, and hit play to test that. You can see that it is gonna be patrolling around. I'll hopefully let this do what it needs to do. So it's gonna be patrolling all the way around. As you can see, it's getting there, just hiding from it so it doesn't see us. Just so we can test that this patrol code still works. And as you can see, it does. It's now going all the way around. So if I stand in front of it, it can see us. It's now chasing us. The music started. What it's going to do is it will stop seeing us. The music's fading out as it stopped chasing us. And it should now continue patrolling. So if we try and find it, it's there. And that didn't work as we missed one tiny thing. And that is again out of this branch here. The true also goes into the reset. So if it is chasing us, it will reset this, meaning we can do it again. So that was just one tiny mistake that we missed. But now it should work. So if we test it again, we already know the patrol works. So it's going to be starting to patrol everywhere. If we then get it to see us, it's going to start chasing us, it stops seeing us, the music is fading out, and it is now continuing on with its patrol, it went back to where it left off. So if we try that again, it's seeing us, it's chasing, it stops seeing us, the music fades out, and it's going to go back to where it last went off and continue on its patrol. So as you can see, it's now patrolling all over again. So that works perfectly. It's coming back around on its patrol and it saw us, like so. I'm going to stop that as the music is quite loud, but that works perfectly. So what we've done is now merged our AI patrol and AI chase. So it's going to be patrolling like normal. If it sees us, it will chase us. And then when it stops seeing us and stops chasing, it will go back onto its normal patrol path again. So I think that'll be it for this video. So we've done everything we want to do, which I've just explained there. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you found it helpful. And if you did, make sure to like and subscribe down below. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.